get everything lined up. Um, we have an environment like a lot of manufacturing companies. Um, it's all over the map. It's grown over decades um, of IT. So we have everything we had at one point, everything from XP to Windows 2019 server. So we've been trying to get uh, all of our active directories from various acquisitions into a single active directory, get all of the machines to look the same, be on the same image as much as possible. Big Fix is, is fantastic for that. It lets me go out and create like a little analysis to see what version of, say, the Java uh, runtime is on all the machines. And I can see all the different versions and then I can force them all to update and come into compliance. Uh, we're a small team. When, um, four years ago, we had probably four people in operations supporting 2,000 users. We, we've expanded that a little bit, but even with uh, one person per plant to, to physically go lay hands on a couple thousand machines to do updates is, is not very tenable. Before Big Fix, I would have to have the ops team go around and lay hands on different computers, or I would have to RDP to different computers and try and manually patch or manually remediate um, certain things. I mean, obviously with WSUS, but I, I found WSUS fails as often as not, and it doesn't work well on third party. So it, it's great if you're patching Microsoft, but what about all the Adobe updates and the, and the Java updates? WSUS doesn't cover those, so big fix. You know, there tends to be tons of stuff. It's like a game of whack-a-mole. As, 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 as soon as you patch some of them, some more pop up. Um, but the, the VPR at least lets me focus on the ones that I know someone can exploit on me. So there may be a vulnerability, but if there's not a, if there's not a known, if you can't go out to GitHub and download a way to exploit it, it's not as dangerous in my view as the ones that actually have stuff you can download. And so I can focus on those first. Right. But you take that Power BI, you right click, you get a list of all the vulnerabilities with applicable fixlets, you drop it into a wizard and big fix and you push out a patch and boom, you fix them all. It, it takes about 15 minutes to build, to build that uh, baseline. 